And let's begin. Open up the hands. Inhale up. And exhale. In, lifting the chin up. Shoulders down. Exhale. Chin comes down to the chest. Again, inhale up. Looking up at the hands. Exhale, release. The chin comes down. One more time. Inhale up. And exhale. Widen your feet as wide as the mat. Lengthen through the spine. Hands are down by our thighs. Keep the right hand down. Open up the left palm. Inhale up. And exhale, side bend to the right. Keep equal weight on both feet. So again, we're centering our pelvis right in the middle of the mat. Letting the stretch come from the hips, extending through the fingertips. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Inhale, let's slowly come up with control. Keep the shoulders down. And at the top, exhale, release the left hand down. Left hand stays on the thigh, open up the right. Inhale, arm up. Stay here. Make a little muscle mind memory of where your hips are, right down the middle of the mat. And then exhale to the left. So we're anchoring through both feet, keeping the pelvis still. Stretching and lengthening the spine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, let's gently come back up. Exhale, release the right hand. Bring your hands to your back. Shoulders and elbows pointing backwards. We'll do a supported back bend here. Take a breath in. And as you exhale, bring those elbows even further back behind your body. Inhale, lengthen the spine and exhale, find your back bend. If you find it hard to keep your elbows bent, like I do, I'm simply lengthening my arms down my back. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Inhale, let's slowly come back up. Exhale, release the hands to your sides. Rolling down, forward fold, take a breath in. As we exhale, drop the chin, round the shoulders, and start rolling slowly down. And as we did yesterday, take your time. If you find a point where you feel some tension, stop right there. Take a few breaths. Feel the relaxation commence and then continue on rolling down. And just hang out here.
Counting down, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's roll out. So as we inhale, just do the opposite direction, rolling the body up, keeping the chin tucked, shoulders rounded until you get to the top. And as you lengthen the spine, the shoulders come back into position and the chin is in neutral. Open up the hands, inhale the arms up once more. And exhale, release the hands down. Closing the gap between your feet, coming in your Tadasana, feet are hip width apart. Let's work and focus on our balance. Standing leg is the left leg. Inhale, lift the right knee up in front of the hip. Square off the hips. Stabilize that left standing leg. You choose, hands can come to hips or inhale the arms up overhead. Hands together and hold here. Focus is on the standing leg and squaring the hips, lifting the arch of the left foot, slight external rotation of the whole leg, holding eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One legged chair, go ahead and cross that right ankle over the left thigh, exhale and sit in your chair. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, rise up, bring the right knee in front of the right hip once more. Keep your left hand where it is. As you exhale, float the right hand down, grab your right ankle, and let's bring the right heel to the right buttocks. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Returning, bringing the right knee in front of the right hip. As you inhale, let go of the ankle. Right hand is extended up, knee is in front of the hip. Release the pose, take a breath in. Exhale, release the hands, release the right foot down to the mat, toe, heel, try not to fidget, and hold here in Tadasana. Opposite side, standing leg is the right leg. As you inhale, shift the weight to the right leg and left knee comes up in front of the left hip. Square the hips, integrity of the right leg. You choose where you want your hands, inhale the arms up and you can either leave them here or bring them down to your waist. They're both good options. Hold, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One-legged chair, cross the left ankle over the right thigh, exhale and sit. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, rise up, left knee in front of the left hip, square off, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Leave the right arm where it is and float the left arm down, grabbing your left ankle. 
bringing the left heel to the left buttocks, hold, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, inhale, release, left arm extends up, left knee comes up in front of the left hip. Releasing the pose, take a breath in, and exhale, release the hands, release the left toe, heel, into Dasana, hold steady. Chair pose, inhale, both arms up, overhead. Exhale, sit into your chair. Take a quick look down, make sure you can still see your toes and then bring the head back to neutral. Hold here. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, and one. Release the pose. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, release your hands. Stepping back into warrior two on the right side. Shift the weight to the left leg. Inhale, the right knee up in front of you. Square off the hips. As you exhale, go ahead, step the right foot back behind you. Swivel, square the hips towards the front. Lift the right toes up. Inhale the hands up on the line. And exhale into warrior two. Take a quick look down, make any adjustments you would like. Let's hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Extended side angle. Right hand comes down, open up the left palm. Inhale the left palm, hand up, square off. And now exhale and find that beautiful. Extended side stretch here, ankle through the left foot. Lengthen the spine. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, release, come back to warrior two, looking to the right. Reverse warrior, float the left arm down, open up the right palm, square off. Inhale, the right arm up. Exhale, side bend to the left. Hold here, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, let's come back to warrior two. Triangle. As you inhale, straighten the right knee. Engage the right thigh, strong exterior rotation of the right leg. Next exhale, shift the weight over the right leg. Hold here. Committing this position to your muscle, mind, memory. Hold. Four, three, two, one. Exhale, let's come into triangle pose. Lengthen the back.
holding eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Windmill into revolve triangle. Left arm comes in front, right arm scoops behind us, face the opposite direction. Elongate the back as best you can. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, reverse, back to <clears throat> triangle. Safely coming out, bend the right knee first. And now inhale, push up to warrior two on the right side. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Transition to front straddle. Inhale, both arms up. Bring that right foot in. Exhale, forward fold. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming up to a half back. Lift the head, lengthen the back. Send the arms down towards the mat. Reverse swan dive to come up. Inhale, extend the arms out to the side. And then inhale again, rise up. Arms extend overhead. And from here, we simply come into warrior two on the left side. So lift the left toes up, open up that hip, and exhale down to warrior two. Let's hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Extended side angle. Left arm comes down, open up the right palm, square off. Inhale the right arm up, and exhale, extended side angle. Ground through that right leg, right foot. Extend through the fingertips, lengthening the spine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale back to warrior two. Reverse. Gently float the right palm down. Open up the left. Inhale the left arm. Up overhead, square off. Coming into a side bend. As you exhale, side bend to the right. Hold. Counting down. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, let's come back to warrior two. Triangle pose. Inhale, straighten that left knee. Protect the left knee, engage the thigh. External rotation. Exhale, shift the weight. Hold here. And on your next exhale, let's come into the triangle on this side. As you come down, try to maintain 
that little lengthening of the back, protecting the knee. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Reverse. Right arm floats down, left arm floats behind us. Looking in the opposite direction. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's reverse, coming back into our triangle position. Safely coming out, bend that left knee, inhale, rise up, warrior two. Again, coming into a nice front straddle, inhale, both arms up, bring that left foot in, Exhale, forward fold. Reach forward. Extend the spine. And let's stay here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, coming up to half back, lift the head length in the back. Let's come up to our half back. Again, repeating what we did yesterday, keep your pelvis in the center. And as you exhale, walk your hands towards the right foot. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. As you inhale, go ahead, walk your fingers back to center. We're still having a nice long back. Exhale, walk your hands to the left. Keep the pelvis in the center. Look at your feet. Are they parallel to the mat or slightly pigeon-toed? Hold here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, <clears throat> three, two, one. Inhale, let's come back to center. And this time, go ahead and let the head drop down. Now with the head drop down, pelvis is still in the center. Go ahead, exhale, walk your hands towards the right foot. Hold here. Try to keep your hips centered over the heels in the same plane. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, walk back to center. And exhale to the left. Holding here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale back to center. Let's try and widen our stance just a little bit. Toe heel, toe heel, a little wider. And hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Widen the stance a little bit more. Hold. Eight, 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Toe heel, toe heel, back to Tadasana in the center of the mat. And come into a forward fold. Holding here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming into a low chair pose. Bend the knees, lift the head, lengthen the back. Inhale, extend the arms in front of you. And out, inhale, lift the torso into a chair pose. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, right up. Send the arms high overhead. Exhale, release the hands. Let's widen our stance once more. Another front straddle. This time as we come down with the flat back, we're gonna stop halfway down. Open up the palms, inhale, arms up. Go ahead, look at your hands. As you exhale, look at your hands, come halfway down. Keep looking at your hands. Stretch forward. Hold here. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Rise up, inhale, come up. Keep your head right in between your arms. Exhale, release. Same thing. The, the trick here is that when you have your arms extended and your head is in between, try and widen this armpit out and drop the shoulder blades. Keep some engagement there at the shoulder blade level and that will help you keep your arms extended. All right, open up the palms, inhale, arms up. Look at your hands, widen the shoulders, engagement through the shoulder blades. Exhale, come down halfway, keep reaching forward, hips are in line with the heels, Hold, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, rise up. Go slow. Exhale, release. Go ahead. Let's close the distance between our feet just enough so we can come down into a nice, Deep squat. If the squat is not in your practice, come into chair pose. Or what's also nice is just practice sitting and standing out of a chair without using your hands. All right, it's same principles. Open up the palms, inhale, hands up. Hands together or close together. Exhale, let's bend our knees, passing through chair and coming down into a nice wide squat. Bring the hands in front, round the shoulders, tuck the chin. Hold here. Coming into a forward fold, release the hands down to the mat. Inhale, lift the hips up. We're back in our forward fold. Using a nice straight back to come up, lift the head, lengthen the back. Come into a half back, arms are extended down towards the mat. Inhale, extend the arms up so your head is in between. And now inhale, rise up. And exhale, release. Two 
Tohil Tohil, back to Tadasana. Close the eyes. Commit to muscle mind memory, this alignment. Four, three, two, one. Exhale, release, and let's meet on the mat. Coming into a cross legged position on your mat. Prop top gazing or eye gazing, bringing our hands in front of us, a soft uh, punya, fist with thumbs up. As I inhale, I bring the thumbs up. As I exhale, I bring them down. Try not to move your head and just let the eyes go up and down. We'll do it on a nice five count second. Inhale and exhale. So, head is in neutral, you're looking down at your thumbs. Let's begin. Inhale, two. Three, four, five. Exhale. Two, three, four, five. Inhale. Two, three, four, five. Exhale. Two, three, four, five. Do it again on your own. Try and keep your shoulders down. Left hand stays down. We're moving the right thumb diagonally from the left knee up to the corner of the right. Sitting up nice and straight, shoulders are back. Right thumb is near the left knee. Let's begin. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, Three, four, five, exhale. Two, three, four, five. Inhale. Two, three, four, five, exhale. Two, three, four, five. Switch sides, rest the right hand, bring the left thumb towards the right knee. Let's begin. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Last one, inhale. And exhale. Make a fist with both hands. Bring the hands in front of you. Peripheral vision. We start here with an inhale. And as we exhale, we open up the arms. Let's begin. Inhale, look at the thumbs. Two, three, four, five. Exhale, open up the arms. Keep the head in the middle. Four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four. Five, exhale. And inhale, come back to the center. And hold here, looking at both thumbs, relax the shoulders down, length of the spine. If your eyes start to hurt, simply close them until the discomfort goes away and then open up again.
And exhale, let's release the pose. Bring the hands in front of you, roll the shoulders back. A nice forward fold. Just to stretch out a little bit. And hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming out of the pose, lift the head, lengthen the back. As you inhale, draw the hands back towards the center of the body. Coming into a nice seated spinal twist, left hand comes to the right knee. Inhale, the right arm up, the square of the shoulders. Lengthen the back. And on your next uh, exhale, find the twist. Again, square off the shoulders. And then when you're ready, float the right hand down behind you and find your twist. Remember, we're not pushing with our hands. You can do this twist without touching the mat or touching your body. And hold. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, and one. Coming out of the pose, inhale the right arm up behind you. As you exhale, come back to center and release the right hand. Opposite side, right hand to the left knee. Inhale the left arm up. Lengthen the spine, drop the shoulder, square up the shoulders. On your next exhale, let's find the twist. And perhaps here is a good time to simply lift the right hand up, let it float over the left thigh. Exhale, release the left arm. You're in your twist. If you'd like, lift up the left hand also so it's floating over the mat. Square your shoulders and hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming out of the pose, inhale the left arm up behind you. Exhale, come back to center and release. Sitting up nice and straight, close your eyes. Hands are lightly resting on our thighs, lengthen the back. Try and find that really nice stable position where you feel both seat bones, sides of the ankle, sides of the feet on the mat. Spine is lengthened and the belly is nice and soft. Head is in neutral position. And you can stay like this and practice your five second inhale and exhale, or if you'd like, we can do two minutes of alternate nostril breathing. So if you choose to do alternate nostril breathing, turn over the palm of the left hand, lightly touching the thumb to the pointer finger. Palm is open. Right hand, you bring the pointer and the middle finger towards the pads of the thumb. Turn the hand towards you. The thumb will close the right nostril. Ring finger will close the left. You start on an exhale on the left and you end on an exhale on the left. Go ahead and start.
Take your time, but we can end with an exhale on the left nostril. And then you gently bring your right hand down and you breathe through both nostrils. Stay here in your practice, stay in the stillness, stay with that one point focus to the best of your ability. And then maintaining that beautiful soft breath, go ahead and open your eyes. Come back to awareness. So depending on how you feel, you can come into Savasana right now, or I can leave you here. Really, you, you know what is what your body needs. If you're ready to finish your practice, inhale your hands to heart center. Take a breath in and exhale, bow down to the teacher with it. Then inhale, come back up. Namaste. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for your patience and, and my apologies again for the delay today. Thank you. Thank you, Corinne. Thank you, Corinne. Bye, everyone. Hi. Sorry. Hang on. You have a beautiful sunrise in the background. I just love all oh. the colors. Yeah, the clouds while you were, while you were on the mat were so beautiful. Yeah, it was strange, really? and they were vibrating. And they, they were beautiful. Were picture of it in the end because it was so beautiful I couldn't stop focusing on the clouds <laughs> well that's maybe that was the idea it looked like a cartoon like when they paint cartoon backgrounds into movies yeah exactly exactly yeah and it wasn't like this here you know this is another mountain and it's this is just gray here so it's very it was beautiful Margaret there's your inspiration for another um felt <laughs> yeah oh yeah now I now I want to go on doing that yeah yeah. yeah. Okay. Good day, everyone. Goodbye. Have a great day. Davinder's going back to bed. <laughs> Good plan. All right.